project. And she can help you with a lot of questions that you may have. And she's a very bright looking lady, so we, we, we wish you good evening. Several folks from GDAC. Oh, somebody else? Uh, yes, before I came over this evening, I was watching the weather station, the weather channel. Approaching Birmingham, Alabama was a new tornadic category, level 10. Never before has the weather channel described their tornado as a weather a, a level 10. Not only are we going to lose our watersheds and the destruction described as so eloquently by these gentlemen tonight, we are moving to a cataclysmic period of climate change. Let us remember that methane is 33 times more powerful than greenhouse gas and CO2. Not only are the, the leaks from the methane building up in our atmosphere from gas production from the shale, we're also releasing methane from the permafrost areas throughout the world. This is a cataclysmic crisis we're facing. The question I ask of the panel, when do we start linking this up to the end of fossil fuel capitalism and a transformation of our society much deeper than the surface type of reforms that we're describing this evening? We don't have the luxury of time. I just came back from meeting in New York City for the left forum. I heard people talking about secession. Secession New York City out of the United States because of the failure, the failure of the failure of the rational policy coming from all of you. This is we are in the same position as the United States was in 1856. We're approaching a 